Welcome to another Rabbit Hedgehog video tutorial. For any questions, email me at rabbithedgehog at gmail.com, and that's with two Bs. And for any links or places mentioned in the video, just view the description to the right, or if you're on my website right now, just look above. And today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to password protect any file on your computer. So, the first step is to just open up any browser you have, like Mozilla Firefox, and, and then just go to the URL bar and type in www.download.com. And then the search box near the top, just type in um, 7, the number 7, dash, sorry, 7 dash zip. And then just click on the first one in the list there. Now what 7-Zip is, is it's a free file compression program. And it has just as much features as other file compression programs such as WinZip and WinRire. But both of those uh, cost money and 7-Zip is completely free. And it has a 5-star rating from the editor. Um, full of spyware, tested spyware free here. So I just click down now. And then click save file on the box that comes up. It will only take about 10 seconds. Okay, so just double click on the exe file. Click OK. Click run. Click install. And then you should install 7-zip on your computer. Um, then you can just go to any folder that you want, any random folder such as my documents or any folder really. And then uh, on the right, on the, sorry, the left pane, uh, under file and folder tasks, just click make a new folder. Or you can also just right click, go to new, and click folder. Now we'll also make a folder. Um, so just right click on the folder you just made type and click on rename and then just type any name for that folder such as um, password protected folder I just click anywhere and just open the folder and now you can just uh, open up any other folder which and then uh, just take any files that you want to password protect and um, drag them drag them into the folder you just made drag them into the password protected folder so here's the file I'll drag just another file into there and quit uh, that folder and then um, click up on the password protected folder right here and then right click on that and then go to 7-zip right in the top in the uh, top area here sort of under open uh, so it should say 7-zip and then click add to archive and now you just have to uh, make sure that the archive format is zip because it normally says 7z and that we don't want that we don't want a zip so make sure that on the top it should say password protected folder or whatever your folder name is dot zip then on the right pane um, it should say encryption under encryption just enter your password that you want to um, access your files and make sure that whoever you don't want to access your files uh, doesn't know this password and make sure that the show password box is unchecked and that the encryption method is zip crypt uh, sorry and now right next to the password protected folder it should create another uh, folder except this is not a natural folder it's a it's a zip um, so and so it should have a zipper on the folder and not it shouldn't look like a regular folder, it should look like a folder with a zip on it. 
So um, now you can just click on the uh, zip folder. There should be another folder in that. And then here are our files. Now say I was some bad hacker person who wanted to steal these files. Then I would be like, oh yes, finally the document I was looking for, yo-yo. <laughs> now view it. Okay, I'm going to click on it. That's going to be like, oh no, password is needed. File yo-yo is password protected. Please enter the password in the box below. Oh no, okay, I think it's this one, password. Oh no, I was wrong. Okay. And then, if I was actually me, which I am, then um, I'll type in my real password to access the file. Click OK. And it should open the uh, file, which it did. Same with this. That also worked. And uh, basically, nobody can guess this password. Nobody can hack into this password, um, except for anybody who has the, who actually has the password, like you, um, because it's um, encrypted, um, which means that the bunch of like letters and numbers that uh, the password translates into, and basically nobody can. Uh, translate that encryption into uh, the password that you entered which means that um, that also means the government I mean, like not that you would be keeping anything from the government <laughs> um, not even the government can uh. for more information just visit my website at rabbithedgehog.co.nr and that's with two B's and do not forget to subscribe just press that little yellow button to the right or on my channel Thank you for watching.